Theater Aviation Brigade are more trained and more ready than we have ever been and boast an impressive record of accomplishments. I'm Colonel Jeff Copeland. I'm honored at the opportunity and extremely proud to be the commander of the 449th Aviation Brigade. Over the next few minutes, I'd like to share with you the Brigade's history, accomplishments, and challenges that lie ahead as we continue to operate as part of North Carolina National Guard's Always Ready, Ready Team. Our unit's shoulder sleeve insignia is distinct, and although fairly new, it is becoming recognizable throughout Army aviation. The 449th traces its lineage back to the Aerial Forward Observer Company assigned to the 30th Infantry Old Hickory Division. Units within the 449th have deployed around the world in support of major operations in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Africa. In 2003 and 2004, the 1st to 130th mobilized in support of Operation Enduring Freedom to Afghanistan supporting the 10th Mountain Division and was the lead aviation unit in Operation Mountain Resolve. In 2008, the 449th Headquarters deployed to Iraq and assumed the role of Multinational Division's Central Combat Aviation Brigade and was later assigned additional battle space controlling the largest area of responsibility of any aviation brigade in theater. Task Force Panther served under Multinational Division South executing over 1,400 combat missions and was recognized as the Outstanding Reserve Component Battalion receiving the Walter T. Kerwin Award for Readiness. The 2nd of the 130th Airfield Operations Battalion has deployed twice, the detachment to Kuwait in 2009 and most recently the battalion deployed in December of 2012 supporting Operation Enduring Freedom where the AOB conducted over 95,000 safe aircraft movements, 800 radar approaches, and 11 airfield renovation projects. Charlie Company, first to the 131st, known as the Kill Devils, is our UH-60 Black Hawk Assault Company located in Salisbury, North Carolina. In January 2005, the unit deployed to Iraq flying over 4,400 combat hours. In April 2011, the unit deployed again to Iraq in support of Operation New Dawn, flying over 4,500 combat hours. Attachment 1, Bravo Company, 2nd of the 151st Security and Support Battalion, received their first UH-72 Lakotas in 2008. Since then, it's been a leader in hoist training. The detachment has provided aircraft and crews for the Southwest Border Mission in Texas in support of the Customs and Border Patrol, flown in support of North Carolina's Counter Drug Task Force, and supported the Saberni Consequence Management Reaction Force. Detachment 17, Operational Support Airlift Command, is our Army Fixed Wing Detachment located at the Raleigh Durham Airport with a C-26E Metroliner 14-passenger turboprop. The detachment has mobilized twice in recent years in support of Operation Enduring Freedom. On the domestic operations front, the 449th has been activated for state duty for Hurricanes Fran, Floyd, Katrina, Irene, and Superstorm Sandy. Our mission is to provide aviation, aviation command and control, aviation support, and other general support force packages in response to natural disasters or other requirements when called on by the governor. The 449th is a major partner in our state's North Carolina Hilo Aquatic Rescue Team, or NC Heart. NC Heart provides a helicopter search and rescue that's not otherwise available anywhere within the state. North Carolina Heart is comprised of North Carolina Emergency Management, North Carolina National Guard, the North Carolina State Highway Patrol, and 12 different fire departments comprising over 42 first responders that serve as our NC Heart technicians. All of Reserve Component Aviation faces significant challenges with the Army's Aviation Restructuring mission. Our National Guard crew members adhere to the same standards and requirements as our active duty brethren, but are a much more cost-effective force as compared to the active component. Our focus 
with our federal mission is on ensuring our attack aviation remains within the National Guard and our attack recon battalions continue to serve as an interchangeable combat reserve force as part of the total Army team. The future looks bright for the 449th Theater Aviation Brigade. I am sure we will rise to the challenges that lie ahead and continue our impressive record of mission accomplishment across the spectrum of aviation operations. I'm proud to be a member of the 449th Aviation Brigade and know that we will remain a ready, reliable, responsive, and relevant aviation force of choice for both our state and nation. Always ready.